Hi, this is Tom Malloy. Today I have a question for you. What compromises are you making on your film? Here we go. Hi, my name is Tom Malloy. I've raised over $25 million for financing movies, produced at the time of this video 16 films, written 30 plus screenplays, ops and sold or made in movies, 24, 25 of those screenplays, and I've starred in a bunch of movies. So I'm an encyclopedia on filmmaking. Okay, a lot of times when you're trying to get a film going, you have to make some compromises. Now, those could be from little things like, well, you're gonna shoot in a diner, but then you have to shoot in this mini cafeteria. Okay, that's not really that much different. You wanted the retro 50s diner, but it's not available, so you gotta shoot in this cafeteria. Maybe you could still make it work, right? So that's a compromise, but there are bigger ones. Say someone says, yeah, I'll finance your movie, but I wanna direct it. Okay, and then you look at their directing. What have you directed in the past? You see something that you put together and it's horrible. So that would be a big compromise. If you're gonna put that person as the director of your film, it's like, oh, wow, he, he hasn't done anything, you know, that, that, that looks even remotely good. That could be a major mistake. So you have to weigh those compromises. One of them that I see all the time is when you look and you see an independent film and there's a couple stars in there and then there's one person you haven't seen before and they are the worst part of the movie. Uh, as a joke, an inside joke between producer friends, we've all pointed to that and be like, oh, that's the person that brought the money. And that's happened, you know? And I'll tell you that that was a big thing for me because a lot of times in my earlier films, like The Attic, which was Elizabeth Moss and myself and Alexander Daddario, uh, I was the person that arranged the financing and I was playing that role. So I tried the hardest to make sure that no one could ever point and be like, oh, that's the guy that brought the money to it. I wanted to be the one that was the best one in those movies. And I think I pulled it off across these movies that I did, okay? And so that for me was a big goal because you never want to be the weak point in the movie. So again, it's compromised. In that case, if some, some uh, person bringing the money and maybe they're a bad actor or actress and they say, well, I got to play this lead role, for you to make that movie, that would be a compromise. So you have to understand that compromises are what could potentially kill your movie. Uh, our head of acquisitions, I've heard him ask this to a lot of filmmakers. What compromises did you make? Just to find out what they sacrificed. And the laundry list of stuff that they will go through. Well, we had to do this. We really wanted to shoot this at night, but we had to shoot it during the day because we couldn't afford to get these places at night. Whatever it was, they would list them. And understand that those are things that you have to weigh. You have to go, you know, if that director says, uh, he'll, yeah, I'll finance the movie, but I got to direct it. You go, uh, I have to weigh that. Can, is there a way then, can I get him a great TP that's going to follow him? Can I get somebody to serve as executive producer and just follow that person around and see if they're going to be good enough to, you know, kind of guide that person? You have to weigh him. So maybe there's solutions that you could figure out. And I always say, don't leave money on the table. But again, compromises can be the thing that kill your film, no matter what they are. So you always have to weigh, do I want to make this compromise? And in the long run, how is it going to affect the movie? If you want more videos on filmmaking, check out the link below. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.